many a times you might be given extraordinarily large numbers. Let us say, suppose someone were to give you a number and ask you to multiply it or read it out. Now you can't read it out simple numbers that easily. Rather, these large numbers that easily. So there is a simpler way of doing it. And what is it? Let us see something. Suppose you had a number 37. Now 37 can be written as 3.7 into 10. Right? How about 370? 370 can be written as 3.7 into 100. Or 3.7 into 10 to the power 2. Now, let's see if you have 3700. Now, it is much more easier to read out these numbers rather than this. Okay? So, simply, whenever you have these large numbers, you can reduce them to the standard format by putting them as a power of 10. And how do you do it? Suppose you have this number. What is the first number that you have? 3. So you can write it as 3 into 10. That will take care of only this portion, 30. Then you count the number of zeros. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So you can write this as 3 into 10 to the power 14. So what you did was you basically counted the number of zeros from the tens position. Okay, the number of digits they were, that were there and then put that as a power of 10. Thankfully we had 3 here. If instead of 3 there were numbers, you would have to appropriately classify them. But the process is simple. You just pick up the first number which is below 10. Okay. In this case, it was 3. I mean, can't put in 3.7, unlike the example that I told you. And then you count out the number of digits, the number of numbers, actually, which occupy the places, into 10 to the power 14. Because 14 were the number of zeros which were there to the right-hand side of 3. Let's take another example. Suppose you had to write it down as... Let's not take this. 4, 5, 7. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Now you need to reduce this below 10. So below 10 can be what? It can be 4.57. Because anything to the left hand side of 10. What is the 10 here? 45? For 45 you put in 4.57 into 10 and how many numbers are there how many digits are there before so you start from 5 keep on counting 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so 10 to the power 8 so that's how you simplify these long long numbers